Hello, this is Amir from root25.com. Today I have a tutorial about how to install Android on your virtual machine. So basically, for installing Android on virtual machine, you have to download the specific uh, version of Android that you can access from android-x86.org. I already uh, downloaded that uh, version. So you need to come to download section over here and then you can uh, download the uh, older version as well but uh, I, in this uh, video I will show you how to install uh, version 4 RC2 uh, I, I, don't, I, I already downloaded uh, this pack uh, you, can, you can download uh, any of this it depends I download uh, uh, Lenovo because my system is currently Lenovo, but it's uh, irrelevant because uh, it's not necessary. It's going to be installed on a virtual machine. So basically all of them is uh, possible. Uh, so uh, I already download this one and uh, then you have to go to your uh, VMware, VMware or whatever, what uh, virtual machine you have here today, I, I'm going to install on a VMware workstation. So from file menu, I will choose a new virtual machine, typical, next. Uh, from here, I will choose the ISO file that I downloaded uh, from the website. And then I will click uh, next. Um, it will uh, recognize the operating system as FreeBSD. I will change the name uh, to Android, Android 4, then next. Uh, here also you can uh, choose the location that you want to install. I will just leave it on to see. Next. Then I will choose the maximum size of the hard disk, 4 gigabyte for example. And I will choose, I want this uh, hard disk as a single file. Next. And this is a summary of the installation. Power on the virtual machine after creation. Finish. Okay, starting to boot up the virtual machine. From this window, you have to just uh, click on the screen to give the control to virtual machine. Then with the down arrow key on your keyboard, come on the installation. Press enter. Okay. In, in this section, you have to choose uh, cre create or modify partitions and press OK. In this screen, uh, basically you can uh, you you have to make a new partition. So we choose new uh, type is uh, primary, and I will uh, dedicate all the space that I have on my hard disk to this partition. And after that, I will come to write uh, to write the partition table on this partition. I will click enter. I will press enter and then uh, you have to choose yes. So I will type in yes, enter. Okay, successfully partition table wrote. And uh, then you have to choose choose uh, the boot table item. Okay, uh, we are done here. So I will choose uh, quit to go back to the previous page. In in this in this section now we have the new partition SDA one Linux VMware virtual at the time. So I will choose okay. Uh, we're gonna format the partition as ext3. Okay, yes. Uh, yeah, it, 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 it's asking that uh, I want to install the bootloader grub. I will say yes, I want to. And do you install, do, do you want to install uh, system directory as read and write? Yes. After a while, it will install the Android 86 on your virtual machine
okay uh, in this uh, page uh, showing that uh, Android are already installed successfully so you just need to click uh, run Android okay I will full screen Here you will see the Android logo that booting up. For the first time, it needs a little bit time. Okay, here uh, I will click on start. You can see that uh, Android successfully installed, and it's on a first wizard at the beginning of boot. It's gonna ask for username and password for Google account and setting time and date. I just leave it next. About the Google account, I will choose not now. About the location, although although I guess name is root25.com. Next. Oh yes, I agree with the terms and condition finish so basically this is the desktop and the tips that Android showing us how to use it uh, battery antenna back button and uh, here the menu okay I want to go to setting and uh, about tablet Basically, uh, as I said before, I choose IdeaPad. So here, show the model number IdeaPad and the Android version 4.0.4. .4. And going back to the main screen, this is the desktops that you can see I, I switch between them. And uh, that's it. This was uh, my tutorial. About how to install Android on your virtual machine. Please uh, like us on our Facebook fan page and follow us on Twitter as well as uh, Google+. Thank you.